Hey y'all, it has been a whole century since I did a video, or me and my husband has did a video, and as you notice, he is not here, um, cause I kicked him to the curve. Just kidding, I didn't kick him to the curve, but, um, I just decided to do this video for myself, for my women. So, um, this is a video for women only, okay? Men, I doubt it if you want to hear what I'm going to be talking about, okay? Cause it's about our friend that comes monthly. So I heard of um, this thing called um, the period cup. And I'm like, what in the world is a freaking period cup? Like, what? what is it? <laughs> I don't know. I don't even know why I'm even gonna try it. But, it, well, here's why I'm gonna try it. Because one, um, tampons are just the worst. I absolutely hate the way they feel. Um, I know it's supposed to um, have a lot of chemicals in it that's not good for you. It doesn't shock me that it's not good for you. I mean, I wouldn't think so anyway. But um, it's the period cups are supposed to be better for the environment as well, um, which I guess I'm down for that. It's not like I... I, I I don't like, you know, purposely try and, you know, um, do anything to hurt the earth or anything like that. So when I can, I and I know too, um, to help it anyway, then I try. So anyway, period cups and also pads are um, like wearing a diaper and y'all already know how that is. I hate it. So anyway, so I went to Target and I got um, a period cup. I'm guessing the name of it is salt or salt. <laughs> I don't know, but this is the thing. Um, and it has the cup in there. So um, I did watch some videos on YouTube about it. Um, it wasn't actually this brand. It was a different brand. But um, apparently you just stick it, this cup, up there. I'm going to open it. Um, you stick the cup up you and it's supposed to last for 12 hours I don't know but I'm gonna see and then I'm gonna give you my honest opinion on it um, I'm gonna try and open this thing hold on all right so here's the period cup and I don't know if I said it already but it's reusable I know right that sounds kind of gross I'm not sure how I feel about it, but that's why it's $32, because it's reusable. So in the videos that I watched, um, she basically said that um, she just like poured it out in the toilet, rinsed it, cleaned it, da da da, popped it back in. She said um, that, um, I'm saying she, because I don't remember the video that I watched, I feel so bad, but anyway, um, Trashy Famous, she ain't gonna know that I did this, but anyway, um, she said that she had a heavy flow and so you know pretend this is up and she said hers will always come here because that's one of the things that I was concerned about like I feel like it will somehow overflow or something like that but um, we shall see anyway so here's the cup Ugh. okay so it looks like that okay the instructions, um, faces of people. Oh, okay, they did say that. Oh, mm -mm, I do not want this thing to get dirty. Um, it says something about these little kids on here. Where did it say it? Oh, smile. Your purchase just helped a girl in need receive period care. So I'm guessing that's what these ladies are for. Uh, salt. More than a cup. It's more than a cup. Less waste, I'm sure. Saves money, I'm sure. If it's only $32 for one, I don't I can't see myself um Mm -mm. I don't, mm -mm. I really can't see myself um, using this over and over and over and over again, like month, month, month. Um, I'm, I'm not sure. I, I'll let you know. Um, so it saves money, um, no toxic chemicals, 
Um, it promotes natural pH balance and you can wear it for up to 12 hours before emptying the container. And they had two sizes. They had a small and a regular. This one here is a regular. Um, the, the small was for a light flow and this is for a heavy flow. I never know what my friend gonna be like. So I just got regular. And it comes with a cute bag. So I guess when I'm ready to save it, I could put it in this cute little baggie. Anyway, so I am going to go insert it and I will let you know what's up. Okay. All right. So it's in there. Um, let me just tell you. So it says that you can um, boil it um, for about five minutes or you can wash it. Um, I did both. Um, feel a little like weird. Um, so it tells you to, so I'm gonna use like this thing. So you take it and there's different ways to fold it. You can fold it um, so it's like open, da, 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 da. you squeeze it flat and then you fold it and you kind of like, yes, I gotta show y'all kind of like stick your leg up there or whatever and then just like insert it um it did feel very very weird going in um because i don't know child where is it supposed to go how far up like my fingers don't reach all the way up there like what is it lord help me but um i think that it went all the way up there looking at the photos i know dang well I know dang well I didn't stick it all the way up there because it looked like it's in her guts. Um, I don't know. We shall see. I'm going to go to the gym and um, I'm wearing these colorful pants for a reason. But anyway, I'll let you know how it goes in the next few hours or so. Um, definitely change it to my ugly draws because I ain't going to mess up my Victoria's Secret ones, I'll tell you that. Um, all right. I'll be back. Okay, so it's been a few hours. Um, what time was that? I think that was around like 10 o'clock this morning um, that I did this whole thing. And I went out, trained some clients, and I came back. Um, so it's been about four or five hours. Okay, um, and this is day one of my cycle. So um, I just, during this time of me being out, um, I didn't really feel it. Um, I forgot it was there actually, which is a good thing. Um, but you know that time where you like laugh too hard or you sneeze <laughs> and then you feel like the flow. Um, because I forgot that it was in there, you know, I was like, oh, oh you know. But, um, but anyway, I was like, I'm not fin to change this thing out in a public restroom. So I got to wait till I get home. So anyway um i didn't have any um no stains on the drawers Woo so i guess there weren't any spills but here's the good part so i guess it's the good part um when i went to take it out i actually forgot <laughs> the instructions lord jesus so i was hopping around the house um booty naked trying to get these instructions but anyway um much information okay so i was reading on how to take it out it tells you not to pull on the tab which automatically that's what you're going to do because it's the little thing that's sticking out like this thing it's a little thing that's sticking out so i was pulling on that um trying to get out um and then it tells you to try and like wiggle and like squeeze the cup and um first of all let me say there is no way and if there is a way i need someone to explain it to me how i would be able to take this thing out in a public place i don't i'm not seeing how because i was you know pretty much grossed out doing it here at home um because like even w once you get it out so now what 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 do you do now yes you pour the stuff you know in the in the toilet or whatever but then now you're holding on to it so how am i getting the toilet tissue to wipe you know am i sitting on my lap like what am i doing here because you're supposed to rinse it out um you're supposed to rinse out the cup so if i'm in a public place do i 
take it out of the stall and then rent that what no um we gotta think this through a little bit more because that ain't it um so anyway so it took me a really long time to get this thing out i'm not sure if i have little fingers but there's no way there was no way that i can get my fingers past this tube thing to reach and grab this part to squeeze there was no way and i <laughs> I was seriously, I was like, my husband's not here. I'm going to have to call 911 because this thing will have to come out. I was really scared. Um, but, you know, I tried to do all the different positions that it told me to do to take it out. Honey, it wasn't coming out. That's some serious, you know, hold. Some um, a really good grip they got on this cup. I can tell you that. Um, anyway, once I finally got it out, it just popped right on out. You actually hear the pop you know and um pour the stuff out i advise you not to look um poured it right out you know and then cleaned it and um and then i stuck it back in um so i am going to try it again um i'm like 60% hate it 40% like it only because i like it cuz i'm not wearing a tampon or i'm not wearing a pad but um I don't know. Maybe my body will get used to it. But I can tell you my JJ was like, we doing this again? We we doing it again? Yeah. So anyway, um, so far, so good. Um, I think that's, I mean, that's pretty much it. I'm going to keep trying it and see how it goes. But oh, yeah. Mm -mm. It's not going to last. Um, it's not a month-to-month -month thing. I know they say it is, but it, unless you, you can't boil it. What, you gonna boil it in the pot that you cook in? No. I, I just think that you're gonna have to buy this, unfortunately, every month. Unless y'all can come up with some other idea that's more clean. But anyway, that's my experience on this. Um, I may try that Flex one um, because I know that that's not like an actual cup or something. It's a cup, but like it's not like this. It's um, like the plastic. Wait plastic i thought we was trying to stay with plastic it's something um but i may try it anyway hope you guys enjoyed this video